bill is making its way through the legislature that would make it easier for people to bring guns onto career tech campuses. Two News reporter Asia Victor has talked to people who say it will make people safer and some who say it will do just the opposite. A bill that sits on the governor's desk is coming under fire. It would allow people with concealed carry permits to leave guns in locked cars at career tech parking lots. Tulsa Tech Superintendent Kara Gay Neal completely opposes the bill. It's an invitation to mayhem. Tulsa Tech has 4,000 students, 3,000 are in high school. Neal doesn't like the idea of guns being so accessible to adults in an area where there are so many young people. They disregarded the value of safe havens such as schools and places of public employment. We have child care centers on our campuses. Jin Jin Payne studies engineering at Tulsa Tech. She says the idea of people having guns on campus is a little scary. That is because I don't want somewhere where I'm going. I don't want to risk my life and I don't want others. I don't want the environment that I'm in. I don't want it to be dangerous or risk other people's lives. Senator Steve Russell is the bill's author. He says this legislation is needed so people with concealed carry permits don't have to park off premise, putting themselves at risk during evening hours. Robert Welch is a concealed carry instructor. He's for the bill. Welch says people who have concealed carry permits are responsible adults. I think it gives the law-abiding citizens the right to keep their weapon in their vehicle, locked up and secured, and of course it's out of sight. And these are law-abiding citizens. He's been through serious background checks. These are not the problem. So far, the bill is passed in both the House and the Senate. It now goes to Governor Mary Fallon. Asia Vickers, 2 News works for you. The governor is expected to make a decision on the bill this week.